Let's see how I created this character using the Blockout Pro add-on which I built to make character creation easier. I'm not a 3D character artist and I'm still learning, but I've always been fascinated by their work. After struggling with sculpting many times, I created this add-on to help with the Blockout phase. If you're new to Blockout Pro, check out my dedicated video by clicking the I button. I started with reference images of the character I wanted to sculpt. Using Blockout Pro, I created a new collection and added a primitive with E, then changed it to a sphere via the Pi menu. I usually begin with the hips, extruding, and shaping parts to match the reference. To create the stomach, I simply extruded the hip and moved it forward. For the chest, I extruded the top part of the body, brought it forward, scaled it, and adjusted it until it looked right. I used similar techniques for the other parts of the body. For the fingers, I extruded them first, then duplicated them using the pie menu. This way, I didn't have to create each finger from scratch, which saved a lot of time. For the tail, I created 5 to 6 objects and then used the curve feature to quickly arrange them around a curve. After adjusting their position, they started looking good. Once I blocked out everything, I clicked on Build in the Blockout Pro. This gave me a single mesh. Then I went into Sculpt mode by pressing Ctrl plus Tab button. After that, I voxelized the mesh and started sculpting to add details. And here is the final result. I could have added more detail in Sculpt mode, but I didn't get time for it. So this is how I created this character. Hope you liked the video, and I'll see you in the next one.